Hi, everybody. Alongside Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Welcome to EA Sports. Colorado's out there on the ice. They look ready to go here, Ray, knowing that they could win a championship tonight. Biggest challenge is not to think about the trophy or think about the championship. It's to focus on what your job is. The officials there at center, and I think we are about to get this one underway. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. Great stick work with the steal. Knocked off the puck. Went for the dirty dangle, and it goes sideways. Grabbed along the board by Anderson. Now he takes it over the line. Taken by Salamaki. And a poke check knocks the puck away. And look at this, a three-on-one. Timmins has the puck inside the defensive zone. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. Sent into the offensive zone. Gets a hold of the puck from the right side. Drives to the sweet spot. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Excellent stick work on the play. Tries, lugs the puck through the neutral zone. Hershey's got control of it now from their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Sprong. Takes the feed. And here's a shot. Locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Nice poke check. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Pelos gaining momentum. Bringing the physicality tonight. Along the wing up the neutral zone. Colorado's got the puck against the half wall. Wrist shot from the slot. Stopped by the goaltender. Sharp reaction save. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still looking for our first goal. Hershey's got it in the defensive zone. Here they come on the attack. Puts it on net. Stopped by the goaltender. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. Slides that one right across the blue line. And that's out of reach and out of the offensive zone. Centering pass! Denies him in close. I like the way he tracks the puck here. He's got to find it, and then he gets his body right in front of it. That's a good save. Dismiss that chance. Nearing the midway mark of the period. Still scoreless in this one. Dickinson's won it off the faceoff. Quick pass to Wagner. Hershey's got a hold of it along the wall. Looks to pass it to Johansson. We got a penalty coming up here. Gets to the bench for the extra attacker. Makes the save on the slapper. Again, the denial by the goaltender. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Let's see what the officials are calling. The Eagles are off to the box. Interference the call. Too late to the player. Once the puck's gone, you got to let him skate. Power play unit comes out for the faceoff. Their first power play of the game. The game is scoreless. And now they'll start offensive zone faceoff. Move the puck. Connect on the power play. That looked like a well thought out play. They moved the puck, quickly found the open man, and it's in the net. Well, this is a preferable way to do the power play. I used to hate it when we'd lose the draw. They shoot it down the ice. Now we got to go back 200 feet to start again. This is perfect. Control the draw. One chance, one power play goal.
The Bears take a 1-0 lead here with lots of time to go. Now, there is plenty of time, but you'd love to play from in front, and they'll be thrilled with this goal midway in the period. They fight for it along the boards. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. Colorado's looking to break out of their own end. Stopped by the goaltender. Smothered that in close chance. Sends the pass over. Colorado's got the puck along the boards. Through center. And he slides it quickly to McDonald. Steps into the offensive end. Here's a short pass to Sherwood. And the lane's clogged up blocking that. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. Denies him in front. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. They're picking up steam through the neutral zone. Here they come, three of them. Colorado's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Hershey's got it in their own zone. Dropped him in the open ice. Colorado's in now. Keeps hold of the puck. Stays with it. Copley's going to elect for the face-off and maybe just a chance to play with the puck a little. Well, you get to feel it for sure, but he hasn't had much to do at all. His team's been in control as they lead this game. Inching closer to the midway mark of the period. 1-0 is where we sit at this point. Dickinson's won the draw here in the offensive zone. And they can't connect. The Bears take it along the wall. The Eagles have it against the wall. Handles the puck. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Puck picked up in the open ice. The Eagles played along the wing. Receives the pass. Stones him with the blocker. Denies him again. He's right on it. Two consecutive saves. Tough ones at that. Hershey's capitalizing their offensive abilities here in this first period. The Bears take possession off the faceoff. Hershey's moving it along the wing. Good use of the body on the play. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Loses possession after he takes a little hit. Colorado's got it in their own zone. Brings the puck into the offensive end now. The Bears take possession in the defensive end. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Moves the puck along the half wall. Here's a shot. Nothing doing. Just misses the net, but really the scoring chance is not dangerous if you can't get the puck at the goaltender. Sends a pass over. Close save. How did he get a piece of that? I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. Slides the puck over. Salamaki's going to play it against the half wall. Oh, and he'll be shaking his head on that as they were so close. We're going to back this up again and get another look at this stop the goalie makes. He makes a solid save on a really dangerous chance. James and Ray with you tonight. More than half the period has been played. The Bears lead it 1-0. Off the draw and a nice job locking up his opponent. Dumps it in. The Eagles get a hold of the puck along the boards. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Moves it quickly over to Anderson. Takes the pass. Obstruction penalty coming up. Looks like a hook here. And the play is whistled dead. Here's the call. The Eagles have been handed two minutes for hooking. That's kind of a bad penalty to take. You reach out with your hands and the referee sees your stick parallel to the ice. He's going to call it most times. Another power play opportunity coming up here. Sometimes it's just your night and the way that they've performed on the power play it kind of feels like they're going to get another one. Puck clears the zone. The Bears have it behind the cage. And that slides right out to center ice. Feeds it to McDonald. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. Gets it out of his own end. 
Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. They got to do a better job entering the zone here. They don't have a shot on net, and it's turning into a conditioning drill. They're going back and forth, up and down the ice. Moves the puck. Gilbert's the victim of a hook penalty coming up. Time for the officials to hand out the judgment. And he's going to get two for hooking on the play, Ray. He should. I mean, he gets his stick out parallel to the ice. He gets it across the player's midsection, and that's kind of a red flag for that penalty. Well, things should open up for both sides here with a little four-on-four -four action. Each team playing with four men, and that means that you're going to have a defenseman jumping into the play. If they don't get a good chance, you know the other team will. And he makes the easy save. Here in the later stages of this period, the Bears have taken a 1-0 lead. Tries is quick on the draw. The Eagles ready to go on the attack. The Bears get a hold of the puck in their own end. And as the penalty expires, they'll go to work now on the man advantage. And the puck stopper jumps on top of it to get a stoppage in play. The Bears have controlled this game here in the first period. More shots, more goals. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. They clear the zone. The Eagles gain control of the puck against the wall. Sherwood's got it into offensive territory. Here's the pass with the stop. The Bears play it along the boards. Puck set in, and that will allow for a fresh group of forwards to get out on the ice. The Eagles will play it in their own end. And the power play comes up empty. Both teams back to even strength. Oh, they're going to rue that one. A chance to even the score here. They didn't get it done. And we go back to even strength. Takes that pass back at the point. Quick feed to Carr. Couldn't find the intended target. The Eagles move it in. The Bears get a hold of it. And now it's over to Pilon. Hershey's on the attack. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. There's a whistle as the official's calling for a penalty here. Gilbert's going off for hooking. It doesn't take very long to get on the wrong side of the play. You're a step behind. You've got to slow that guy down. You can't catch him. Maybe you can get away with a hook. Not here. Just tried to play catch-up and got burned. They'll go back to work on their special teams. They've been successful on the power play already, James. So now you get another opportunity. Do not relax. Go pile it on and get another one. And he gets a glove on it to keep it at bay. Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too. So there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeak through. Nearing the final 60 seconds here this first period. Period. Quick shot, stopped by the goaltender. Along the boards, they battle for the puck. The Bears gain possession along the wall. Big time stop there. Anderson's moving the puck through his own zone. They get it out of the defensive end. And now he moves it to Strong. Reads the pass perfectly and picks it off. Great defensive effort with the stick. And loses possession after a solid hit. And that wraps up the first period here. The Bears have a chance for a refresh, but they got to be feeling good, leading 1-0. Programs for tonight's game are available on the concourse. These will complete player listings for both teams, player bios, and informative stories. Second period still to come. We'll take a quick pause and be right back with more action.
And we are just moments away from the start of period number two. The Eagles win the draw here as play resumes with the period now underway. And just a few seconds remain on this penalty kill. The Bears fail to capitalize on the man advantage. Both sides back to even strength. Well, no go on that power play. They were able to move the puck around, and I guess at times it looked dangerous, but just nothing really going on the power play. They let that one slip through the fingers. What a stop as he puts out the fire! Being stopped by the keeper. No time to take a breath. He made that first stop, and then the puck turns around on him again. The shooter lays a pretty good deke on him, but the goalie doesn't go anywhere. He read that well. Lots of time left in this period. Hershey's ahead, 1-0. Good job tangling up his opponent here. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Can't maintain possession after that hit. Look out, a two-on-one. Oh, he stops him with a glove. Great reflexes there. Carr's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same, you wear the same suit all the time. The Bears continue to lead here in this second period, looking strong offensively. Moves it to Sprong. On the attack along the boards. And he slides it quickly to Pilon. Huge steal in his own end. From the neutral zone now. The Bears scoop it up along the boards. Working the puck deep inside their own end. The Eagles have it in the offensive zone. Takes a shot, and that's blocked away. And he makes the save. Copley's simply going to slow it down here, Ray. Do you like the strategy? I do, but he hasn't touched the puck much this period, James, so you get to handle it a little bit here, and maybe a little nervous, so you jump on it and get to reset. The centermen glide into position. The Eagles will go to work here in the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Sherwood. Gets in front of it. Pins him against the boards as they battle for the loose puck. Grabs it in his own end. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. Back to the blue line. Quick pass to Sherwood. Here's a chance! Scores! And they get it back! Now back to level square. You want them to be as aggressive as possible. You've got the other team reeling a little bit. Oh, he tried to make a desperation save there, but he gets beat. Not much else he could do. The Eagles are on the board. They have tied things up here in the second. They've worked hard to get this game back to level. Colorado's got a hold of the puck off the draw. Hershey's got it in the neutral zone. Colorado's grabbed a hold of the puck. Can't hang on after that hit. The Eagles move the puck in the defensive zone. Colorado's across the blue line. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Colorado's got the puck against the wall. Centered out in front. Stopped by the goaltender. Looks to set up at the point now. He scores! What a goal! They barely fish the puck out after the last one. Two goals in 70 seconds. That sure changes things here on the ice. Yeah, the game has completely been turned upside down. These are fun goals to score. You read that the goaltender's dropping into the butterfly, and you know you're going top shelf. You beat him over the glove, it feels great. Colorado's gone up by one here in this second period. Pretty important goal to get to break the tie here as you get into the middle frame, and now you have a chance to control maybe the way the game's played. Scored by number 16. Taken along the wall by Wagner. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Move to the middle. Swing and a miss. And by number Grabs the puck. Four minutes, 43 seconds. Schilling's moving it ahead. Puts it up front. Finds nothing but air on that shot. Picked up along the wall by Johansson. Hershey's got the puck in the defensive end. Colorado's got a hold of it along the wall. 
Here's a short pass to Salamaki. He scores! Well, when it rains, it pours. Man, they are just coming out in buckets right now as they get three straight. Really a dominating performance. Really tough for the goalie to read where the heck this thing's going. I'm looking at the shot. I can't tell where it's going, but the backhander beats the goaltender. Colorado's now up by two in the second. They worked hard to push this lead from one to two. I like the way that they've been playing. Tries, wins it in the neutral zone. Moves it quickly over to Salamaki. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. The Bears gain possession in their own end. Picked up along the boards by Salamaki. And that shot gets caught in traffic. The Bears have it now. Here they come on the attack. Manages to hang on. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. Good check, frees the puck up. Good defensive stop with the poke check. Stop that one. Hershey's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. The Eagles win the draw. Gets it over to Timmins. Colorado's looking to break out. Carries it in. Can't maintain possession. And he sends it across to Strong. Sends it over. Makes the save. More than half the period left to play. The Eagles have all the momentum right now, leading by two. Puck has dropped, and we are back underway. McDonald's got it in the defensive end. Through center along the wing. Almost lost the puck, but hangs on here as play continues. Takes a shot, gobbles that puck up with his chest. And the referee has blown his whistle, bringing a stop to the play. The setters will glide into the dot. The Bears win it in the defensive zone. Nice pass. And now he tries to get it across to Pilo. Shot! Traps that puck tight into his chest. And we're going to get a stoppage here as the referee blows the play dead. The Bears take possession off the faceoff. Can't catch up to the pass. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Moved into the middle. Takes it to the front. Colorado's got the puck along the wall. Hershey's gained possession. Takes the feed. Great save by the goaltender on that one with the stick. Sometimes you're in close. There's no room to put it anywhere. The goalie smothered it all. The Bears gain possession of the puck here in the offensive end. Too much congestion blocks the shot. Trying to get back on the attack now. Gets control of the puck right in front of his own end. Gilbert's taking it from his own end. Up along the wing. The Bears have it against the wall. Along the right side into the offensive zone. And he comes up with it. Couldn't connect on that pass. Centering pass! And another stop! Oh, he's locked right in. A couple of stops in a row there. What a stop! There's the whistle as things will slow down here for a moment. Always a good play. If you're not sure what's going on, freeze the puck. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice. But the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. The Bears have had a lot of good looks offensively, but they still trail in the second. Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Takes a shot, denied by the goaltender. More than half the frame has been played here. It's a two-goal lead we're looking at with the score 3-1. And a solid job tying up his opponent. And that goes wide. Takes the feed. Quick feed to Sherwood. 
Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Sends the pass over. The Bears will play it against the boards. Along the half wall with the puck. Urkens looks around. Handles the puck. And now it's grabbed by Sherwood. He carries the puck up along the wing. What a steal in his own end. The Bears will play it from the defensive zone. Looking to make something happen along the boards. Rocked him in the open ice. Colorado's gained possession along the boards. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Hershey's got it in their own zone. That knocks him off the puck. Pilo's got it along the wing. And they come up empty-handed. Colorado's got it in their own zone. The Eagles played along the boards. And that one's blocked. Receives the pass. Timmons has the puck against the half wall. Moves it to Wagner. Close save and the play continues. Whistle blown as that's redirected into the crowd. Oh, sometimes you think you got lots of room to make a move. Not there. He got closed down and hammered. What a hit. Getting into the later stages of this period. 3-1 is where we're sitting. Fans being treated to a lot of offense thus far. Couldn't make that one happen. Scooped up along the wall by Anderson. Puck scooped up by Salamaki. Snaps one here in the slot. He was locked in there. Quick glove hand here. He gets the glove out to make the stop. The Bears seem almost a little frustrated out there as we near the end of the second period. They've had plenty of chances, just cannot convert. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. Couldn't complete the play. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. It's a two-on-one. Can't connect. Read it perfectly and breaks up the play. Quick pass to Sprong. Looks to get the puck over to Carr. Strong defensive effort. Hammers a shot. Way too much. Congestion blocks that. Hershey's got a hold of it against the wall. Gobbles the puck up there with the chest. And there's the whistle stopping the play. Elon's on the receiving end of this huge hit. Sometimes you've got nowhere to go. Officials getting ready to drop the puck. Puck possession so key in today's game. Hershey's won the draw, and they'll go to work. Denies him! But he came out and challenged him. Good save. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Barron's picking up steam. The Eagles take possession in the neutral zone. The Bears have it from their own end. Sends a pass over. Slides it across. Comes up with the stop. I want to go back to that chance we had just a moment ago. The goalie reads the play well, makes a great save on a really good scoring chance. Just here in the late stages of this frame, the Eagles have been getting solid offensive contributions, leading 3-1. Gilbert stick handling in his own zone. Angles it over to Wagner. Fails to find the open man. Colorado's working the transition through the middle of the ice. Hershey's looking to break out of their own end. The Bears take it across the blue line. And he takes a shot, makes the save. Gilbert's got it now deep inside his own end. Gains the zone from the right. Shot, no, oh, denies him with the save. I think he got the blocker on it. Period comes to an end, and lucky us, we've got one more period to go in what has been a fun one this evening. Hey, fans, don't forget to enter tonight for our team signed poster, which will give away before the end of tonight's game. Big third period still to come. We'll get ready for it. Hope you'll join us.
And we are just moments away from the start of the third period. Moment of truth for one team. Here we go. Third period is underway. Well, we've got two periods under our belts to this point so far, Ray. How do you see things? Hershey's game plan really can't change or shouldn't change too much. They've owned time of possession. They've had the puck a lot. They just haven't been able to catch the game. The Bears have it in the offensive end. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? Here's a short pass to Timmins. No one home on that play. The Eagles are in transition. Into the middle of the neutral zone. Jabs the puck away. And a strong effort on that play. Good hit to pump him off the puck. Snaps it out of the net. Oh, wow! What a save with the glove. We often talk about a goalie's reflexes. You've got to have quick hands to make a glove stop like that. I wanted to look at this again to show you how the goaltender tracks the puck across the front of the net on the play to make the save. Still plenty of time left in this frame. Colorado's got a 3-1 lead. Hershey's got it in the defensive zone. Now he slides it up to Carr. Maintains possession. Into the corner now. Good battle along the boards for the puck. Pokes it away in his own end. Moves it quickly over to Sherwood. The Eagles move it ahead. Great chance in front. And the puck leaves the zone. The Eagles will play it in their own end. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. The Bears go to work on offense. With possession along the wall. Colorado's got a hold of the puck. Handles it along the blue line. Battle along the boards. Hershey's got the puck behind the net. Takes the pass. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Takes it at center. He says, let's get physical on that play. Nowhere for that shot to go through. Quick feed to Carr. Here's an odd man rush. Right in the slot. Quick shot. Oh, what a great stop as he got a piece of it with the glove. There's another stop. With the puck under siege. Can he get out of the zone here? Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Right in the slot, and they can't connect. Slides the puck over. And now he angles it across to Sherwood. The Eagles take it along the wing. Hershey's got the puck along the boards. Nice pass. Hershey's moving it into the offensive end. Move to the middle. Here he is, shot right in front. Denied that one. I like the goalie's positioning here. He was aggressive enough to make a save on a dangerous chance. Big play inside the defensive zone. And the goaltender grabs that one for a whistle to try to slow things down here. That's a dangerous scoring chance, but the goaltender makes a great save as he's able to snuff it out. Hershey's got to be frustrated with how things have played out tonight trailing in this third period. The Bears win it. Here's a chance in front. Oh, just uh, missed. James, this really frustrates a player. You work so hard to get into this position, and you just miss the net. Uh, this coming from a guy who's got 400-plus graves, right? Still lots of time left here in this frame. Colorado's got a 3-1 lead as they have dominated for the most part in this. That one's off the blocker. One of the things he was working on is trying to control where the puck goes after he stops it. The corner is a pretty safe place. The Eagles gain possession along the wall. Moves it to Dickinson. The Bears have it in the offensive zone. And a put check knocks the puck away. Streaking into the attacking zone from the right. The Bears scoop it up along the boards. Hershey's moving it up the ice. Into the offensive end now. The Bears ready to go on the attack. Shuts them down. Quick pass to Wagner. Sends it in deep. The Bears gain control of the puck against the wall. Up the neutral zone now. They've got numbers. Here he is from the slot. Oh, a clutch save. 
Battling for it along the boards. Good heads up play in the defensive zone. Salamaki's lugging the puck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to tries. And he regains control of the puck. His reflexes on display tonight. If you're going to make the save as the goalie does here, you've got to read the play and have the reflexes to execute the save. Puck possession so critical. Another face-off coming up here. Colorado's got it, and they're on the attack. The Eagles take it along the wall. Moves the puck. Hershey's got it across the line. The Eagles gain possession in their own end. Salamaki's got the puck in his own zone. Dishes it to tries. Here they are on the attack. Sends it across. Huge play in his own end to come up with the puck. Pokes it away here in the neutral zone. Takes the feed ahead from the left side. Nice dish from the left wing. There's the whistle penalty coming up. Slashing the call here on this one. Now he got his two minutes worth there, James, as he's fishing away, and all of a sudden he takes the stick back and whacks him pretty good. The Bears once again send out their power play unit. Oh, here you go. Another chance to score in the power play. They've done that earlier in the game. Here's another opportunity. Shot! And the traffic neutralizes that threat. Came up with the save on that play. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. And the puck leaves the zone. Solid check to slow him down. Across the line from center. That pass goes a little sideways. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Can't keep a hold of it. And they manage to clear it. Hershey's got a hold of it along the wall. Feeds it on over to Sprong. Hershey's got the puck along the wall. To his teammate. Comes up with the stop. Puck moved back to center, forcing them to regroup. The Bears have it behind the net. The Eagles' PK unit delivers in a big way. They did enough to kill this penalty off. It's not been a great night for them. It's been just an average one. Yet this time, they come out ahead. Takes the feed. He scores! Well, don't turn this one off yet. Well, you better not. We're still here. If we're here, That's you right. gotta be here, too. That change of direction's tough for the goalie to follow. It's past him before he can react. Hershey's got one back here, yes. Ray. How big is that? Well, it does a lot, James. It changes your mindset. It changes the way you approach this. And you don't have to be reckless trying to get just one goal. And now it's over to Salamaki. Back to the point it goes. Denied by the goaltender. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Slides it back to the blue line. The Eagles have it against the wall. Sends the pass over. They try to maintain possession inside the defensive zone. And they fail to go tape to tape. Picks up the puck in his own end. Nice feed at center moves up ahead now. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Johansson's moving the puck through his own zone. They fight for it along the boards. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Pass back to the point. With the stop. Great defensive stick work on the play. Hershey's gained possession along the boards. Colorado's playing it from the side. Here's a chance right in the slot. Let's it fly. Oh. Scores! Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it.
late goings of this period. The Eagles now lead by two. The Bears win the draw here in the neutral zone. Huck dumped in. Grabbed along the board by Pilo. Big save. He makes the glove stop right from the slot. That's a dangerous chance. Molson's goal-scoring prowess has never been questioned. But in this postseason, he's among the league leaders in goals. The Bears are running out of time as they trail late in this third period. Pilo's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Tremendous read and even greater sacrifice on the block. Hershey's trying to make something happen in the offensive zone. Dickinson's carrying it ahead. And a good use of the body to knock the puck loose. Takes a lot, but still hangs on. Strong defensive effort. Urkamps picks up the puck. Into the offensive zone. Colorado's got a hold of it against the wall. Forces the turnover. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. And it's a quick pass to Strong. Hershey's emptied the net. The extra attacker's now out on the ice. Slides the cross ice pass. Less than 60 seconds left here in the final frame. Fires to the empty net, and that shot dies in traffic. From the left side, they gain the zone. Handles the pass at center. Fires into the empty net. Misses. The Bears get a hold of the puck along the boards. Takes the pass from the left wing. Hangs onto the puck. Takes a shot. Oh, he gets a blocker on it. What a reaction. Fires it down the ice. Can't get it to go. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Too much congestion in front. Have you met Lord Stanley? Well, you're about to hear as they are about to... And there it is. Empty netter. That'll seal it up. Pretty easy one right there for him to cash in. Now that empty netter should wrap this up here. We're in the last little bit of the third period. That should be enough. The Bears have had more scoring chances, and yet they trail late in this third period. champions. Well, they're moments away from hoisting that cup, but first, the always respectful handshake. This must seem like forever, even if you're the winners, because <laughs> you want to get to the championship trophy to hold the cup above your head. It's funny, it's a beautiful trophy, your playoff MVP, and yet nobody seems to really want to hold on to it, Ray. No, because everybody in the building, including the players, is waiting for the next one to be out there and to be presented. And that, of course, is the Stanley Cup. He's coming to collect the Stanley Cup. I can't even imagine how hard his heart is beating right now. It, it must be an amazing feeling. Every time I see them hoist the cup year after year, I feel a little pang of jealousy that I never got to do it. 
Look at this. What a great celebration. Oh, they get to take the tour with the championship. I can't even imagine what that feeling must be like. What an amazing accomplishment to win. And it must be such relief to get your hands on the trophy to realize this is it. This is what I played for. And as they gather for the team photo, there are your Stanley Cup champions. This is the emotional picture, the one with the cup for the first time. The polished one will be in a couple of days when everybody's shaved their beards and combed their hair.